power down your Apple iPhone 7 phone. Eject the Nano SIM card tray. Remove the two bottom 3.4mm pentalobe screws located next to the lightning connector. Use a precision knife to create enough space to insert a triangle opening tool. With the triangle opening tool, slice through the sticky adhesive and carefully decouple the iPhone 7 display assembly from the rear case. Unlike previous iPhone models, the iPhone 7 opens just like a book, along the side instead of at the top. The display assembly is still connected to the iPhone by cables along the middle right side, so don't try to remove it entirely just yet. Remove the following four tri-point screws, securing the bracket that covers the battery connector and two of the display cables. These screws are different sizes, so be sure to remember where they go. With the bracket out of the way, spudge up the cables from the logic board. Remove the following two Phillips screws that secure the bracket covering the upper component display cable. Disconnect the cable and free the iPhone 7 display assembly from the phone. Remove the following six Phillips screws followed by the metal clip they secure in place. Easily extract the stereo enabling speaker. Use the tweezers to help remove the tangled up 7 megapixel iPhone 7 front facing camera cable assembly. It includes the front facing camera, microphone, proximity sensor and ambient light sensor. Remove the following four tri-point screws and then the metal bracket. Separating the solid state iPhone 7 Plus home button is simple, with only light adhesive on the cable and no delicate gasket. Remove the following six tri-point screws. Use the spudger to release the adhesive from beneath the bottom of the iPhone 7 LCD shield plate. 